All right, what's it like coming back here, your hometown area, and being a big leaguer? Uh, it's always a great feeling, yeah. especially last year. We got to end the season here last year, yeah. so that was pretty nostalgic, having my family here and friends. Yeah. And so now coming back this year, it's just been amazing. I get to see all my family and go back home to where I grew up and stuff. So. Yeah. Where, all right, for the fans that don't know, how far from this stadium did you grow up and what was like, life like growing up around here? So I grew up in, it's called Moon Township. Mm -hmm. It's actually right where the airport is. Right when we flew in, we actually drove right past it on the yeah. way to the city. And um, yeah, it's where I grew up. And uh, it's, it's, it's an amazing small town, quiet, yeah. quiet town, uh, but a lot of family there, a lot of friends and stuff. So it's, it's great, it's a great place. Whole family, Pirates fans? Yeah, I would say for the most part. Now Reds fans, but... Uh, yeah, but I mean, growing, you know, it <laughs> yeah, is what it is. Exactly. You're your hometown team. Exactly, yeah. Definitely diehard Steeler fan, Penguin fans, Pirates fans, so all spread throughout the family. You grew up here. Don't hate, right? I, I will say, I will <laughs> say, though, I will say, I didn't grow up as much of a Pirates fan as I did Steelers and Penguins. There you go. So I, I diehard Steelers, <laughs> diehard Penguins, um, but yeah, I was... More of more football. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, how excited are you about the opportunity that you are getting right now at the big league level? It's it's amazing. It's everything I could ever ask for. Just having every opportunity I can to play and help this team win and do whatever I can on that field to, yeah. to help this team win. It's just amazing. You bring hustle, athleticism, energy. Have you always been an energy guy? And do you sense that players, teammates feed off of that? Yeah, I've always been a high energy guy, yeah. and that's always been my, my MO, and that's something I try and carry with me whether I'm having a great day yeah. or, or a tough day at the plate. Like, I don't let that affect my energy in the dugout on the field because yeah. there's always different aspects of the game where you can pick up your teammates, and if I'm not doing it at the plate, I can do it in the outfield and make a big diving play yeah. or in the dugout just cheering on the other guys. So that's something I've always carried with me because that's something I can control. Yeah. That's something I can do on a daily basis is control my attitude and my effort. So that's just kind of how I've always been, just hustle everywhere, hustle hard, play hard, and just try and get that energy going. And one thing I have loved, you are not afraid to lay down a bunt and use your speed, even with two strikes. Yeah, it's something that's been a part of my game since I was young. As a lefty speed guy, it's always been instilled in me that that's always been a big part of my game. If I'm not swinging the bat well, if I'm not seeing it well, I always got that tool in my back pocket. So the two strikes is a pretty recent thing, yeah. um, but it's, it's just another addition to my game. All right, how many ticket requests this weekend? Uh, not as many as last year, because <laughs> because we're here for four days now. Yeah. So I think it'll be all spread out this yeah. year uh, through the series. So, yeah. All right, that is T.J. Frito. Good luck this weekend. Enjoy the fam. Thank you. I appreciate it.